Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to another discussion video about Fallout 76, the new Fallout game announced by Bethesda Game Studios. That surprised me, but to today's point, we have a very important topic to discuss. Where is Vault 76? Of course, Fallout 76 is called that because I would assume that the player character originates from Vault 76, as in the trailer, um, we see that it's in a vault, and at the end, the person in the trailer is wearing a jumpsuit, and on the back it says 76. The game's called Fallout 76, naturally, I would imagine we're gonna start in Vault 76. Now there's, uh, man, there's a, a, a few different pieces of conflicting information about where Vault 76 is located or where Fallout 76 is going to take place. So during the trailer, there is a song playing, and in it, the singer says West Virginia several times throughout the snippet of the song that's in it. Almost heaven, West Virginia. So this is a cover of a song called Take Me Home Country Roads by John Denver, and we'll have a look at the lyrics in a second because it might help us understand where the game will be set. So of course, throughout the trailer, whoever made the trailer or was directed to make the trailer has specifically chosen sections of the song to be sung where the dude is singing about West Virginia. I've seen some people make the argument of like, dude, it's just a song in a trailer. It doesn't mean anything. It's like, bro, every single person that watched that was going, oh my God, Fallout in West Virginia. Why? because we're watching a Fallout trailer and the dude's going, West Virginia. So you're like, bruh, pretty sure this is in West, West Virginia. Again, millions and millions of dollars are put into these kind of trailers. You know, that's like putting a song in about Alaska and then setting it in Texas. That it would be the worst decision ever. So because of West Virginia being blared out while being sung throughout the trailer, people have naturally come to the conclusion that Fallout 76 is going to be in West Virginia. Now the map we'll be using here, it is a little bit outdated, but I have added the new northeastern tip of West Virginia, the state. Um, the reason I'm using this old outdated map is because it's going to be in a lot of the video. I had to find a map that was royalty free. I had to find a map that was copyright free and also a map that contained the three areas we'll be talking about. Maryland, West Virginia, and Virginia. So that's why there's a little green tip at the top of West Virginia. That's just a correction, and that is now part of modern-day West Virginia. So let's take a look at some of the lyrics from the song here. Almost heaven, West Virginia. There it is already. First thing is West Virginia. Then he says, Blue Ridge Mountains, Shenandoah River. Now the Blue Ridge Mountains and the Shen, whatever the river that is, are mostly located in Virginia, not West Virginia. But then a few lines down, he says, country roads take me home to the place I belong, West Virginia. So what he's doing, he's singing about going home basically. And I think the locations along the road to home which is West Virginia. Now, some people have theorized that because he's singing about locations that aren't necessarily or mostly are not in West Virginia, but instead in Virginia, that this means that Fallout 76 will not be set in West Virginia because he's talking about the Blue Ridge Mountains and the Shenan Shenandoah River. So while he is singing about locations that aren't necessarily in West Virginia, the song as a whole is a love letter to West Virginia. And of course, the lyrics chosen to be blared out throughout the trailer is him saying, West Virginia. So, you know, that's in people's heads. Every reaction video I watched of people watching the trailer live, everyone went, oh my God, West Virginia. So if their intention wasn't to get people thinking about West Virginia, they've made a huge, huge mistake. So West Virginia, Virginia, honestly, I think Vault 76 will be roughly in between them, but we need some more information on this first. So. To just add a third state into the mix, Vault 76 might be in Maryland. Um, in Fallout 3 in the Citadel, there is a log that actually lists all of the known vaults in the Washington DC area. And Vault 76 is on that list. Which means, as far as we know in the Fallout lore, Vault 76 is actually in the Washington DC area, which is pretty much in between Maryland and Virginia. Oh, and also, I'm learning about all this right now on Google Maps, so if I get any of this stuff wrong, please feel free to correct me. Now, as you may know, Fallout 3 was set in the Washington DC area, and 
guess what wasn't on the map? Vault 76. So it says that it's in the Washington DC area, then we go to the Washington DC area, and it's not there. Okay. Then we get a trailer for Vault 76, or Fallout 76, set in Vault 76, and the dude's singing about West Virginia. Almost heaven, West Virginia. Which the very north eastern tip of West Virginia is pretty close to Washington DC. It's not a five minute walk, but in terms of country as a whole, it's pretty nearby. So I would not be surprised at all if Bethesda decided to scrap that tiny citadel piece of information about it being in the DC area and just moving it like a hundred or so miles to the left or to the west and just popping it in Northwest Virginia because we don't actually get a specific location for Vault 76 in the Fallout 3 Citadel entry. We just get a vague idea that it's in the DC area. And then once again, when we go to the DC area in Fallout 3, Vault 76 isn't there. So there's some conflicting information, a bit weird, and it definitely makes it a lot harder to kind of nail down where Vault 76 actually is. And to make this even weirder, the second the trailer ended on the stream, I went to Vault 76's Wikipedia page and it said it was located in Virginia. And now that's been changed to Washington DC. So what's really weird to me is before the trailer was released and anyone knew that Fallout 76 had something to do with West Virginia or at least the song was being sung, before Vault 76 and Virginia were connected ever, the Wikipedia page said it was in Virginia. And as far as I can tell, there is no in-game information saying that it's in Virginia. So that was very confusing. I don't know what happened there, but it's very weird. And it's very weird that a state that was a mistake was exactly where the new information is telling us we're going. Really weird, I don't, I don't know what happened there. But because I can find no in-game references to it, it's irrelevant at this point, but very weird, very strange. Now, if you watch my trailer analysis for the teaser for Fallout 76, you will have noticed that I pointed out the Vault 76 jumpsuit that we see in the trailer isn't blue and yellow, it's blue and gold. Of course, the classic Fallout colors are blue, cool, and yellow, cool, but not present in Fallout 76's trailer. It's blue and gold. Blue and gold. Why gold? What does that mean? Well, if you look at Maryland, we have red, white, black, and gold. Gold, but there's no blue. If we look at Virginia, there's just none, apparently. And it says the flag background is blue. Okay. Oh, would you look at that? West Virginia, old gold and blue. Gold and blue, the exact same colors that we saw on the jumpsuit. And of course the jumpsuits are normally blue, but they're also normally yellow. But this one, in Fallout 76's teaser trailer, where the guy's singing about West Virginia, instead of yellow, has gold. Which, funnily enough, suits the colors of West Virginia to the T. Coincidence? I don't know. Very strange nonetheless. So what do we have so far? Fallout 3 tells us it's in the Washington DC area. Then in Fallout 3, when we go to the Washington DC area, it's not there. Then the Wikipedia page before the trailer came out said it was in Virginia for no reason. And it has since changed to Washington DC area. Then in the trailer, the guy is singing about West Virginia, making us think or associate Fallout 76 and Vault 76 to West Virginia. Then the jumpsuit, instead of being blue and yellow, is blue and gold. Blue and gold are the colors of West Virginia. So far, we kind of got three states or... So DC is, well, it's called DC because it's the District of Columbia and isn't strictly in Virginia or in Maryland either. But of course, it's touching both of them. So we kind of got Maryland, Virginia, and then West Virginia. So it's like, where is this place? Where is Vault 76? To be quite frank, we just don't know at this point. But there is another really weird thing I want to take a look at, and it's in the real world. So a few of my Twitter followers have linked this to me, didn't think anything of it at the time, but after mulling it over, yeah, there could be something here. So there's a place called the NRQZ, the United States National Radio Quiet Zone. It's a large area of land in which radio transmissions are heavily restricted by law to facilitate scientific research and military intelligence. And where is this located? Well, it's located over West Virginia, Virginia, 
and a very small part of Maryland. So this like secretive Area 51-esque area is right over the three states in question. Not quite touching DC or the District of Columbia, although that's not a state. I don't know what's going on with that thing. But there's a lot of weird things going on here. And while we don't know for sure, I'm willing to hedge my bets that Vault 76 is going to be located in West Virginia. And if not, it'll be somewhere between DC and West Virginia. And even then, I feel like most of Fallout 76 is going to take place in West Virginia as, again, a lot of time, money, planning, editing goes into making these trailers, okay? They wouldn't choose a song where the guy is yelling West Virginia unless they wanted people to associate Fallout 76 with West Virginia. Again, I thought it. Every single reaction video I watched, the people watching went, oh my god, West Virginia. Why? Because in the trailer, the dude's singing about West Virginia, that's why. And going back to the National Radio Quiet Zone, if there's any area that fits the bill for putting a vault, it would be this place, for sure. And it's right near all the areas we're talking about, so... I would imagine the Vault 76 will be located somewhere in this square. Of course, I could be 100% wrong, but there's all of my information, there's my thinking and deductions from this information. So of course, be sure to let me know your thoughts on this and where you think Vault 76 will be, or more importantly, where you think Fallout 76 will take place. So thanks very much for watching. Be sure to follow me on my social medias. And if you have any cool information, leave a comment. Or if it's really cool and urgent, be sure to hit me up on Twitter. So thanks very much for watching. I've been Camel, and I'll see you very shortly in probably West Virginia. I'll see you there.